ball game. Uh, uh, I thought we thought we had some things that, that we did we hadn't done all year. I thought defensively we acted like we uh, were there to make plays and not as uncomfortable with assignments and uh, played with some anticipation, uh, which means the scout report and the and the game plan came together in a comfortable way where guys could just and that's I think the reason that we made a lot of plays on defense. Uh, actually scored four times on defense, three of them counted. Um, a particular note, Brooks scored one time, but a particular note is the other three were freshmen. Uh, ben Endress and Pierre Warren and Jamal Johnson from Piedmont. So uh, that's the other point in this game. I think we got to play and see uh, more players. Uh, I think it's obvious from anybody that saw the game that uh, that uh, Kuda is going to be uh, uh, an integral part of things. Uh, I thought he did a great job uh, running the football, and and uh, we've all known here that he could bring a lot to to help us win. So uh, we played another freshman, the majority of the game on offense at left guard, Blake Burke. But still, this football team is, is um, being led by the older players, starting with the front four. Monte sitting here and his three other uh, two senior up front, uh, across the front, and, and uh, Jamison Wadley and, and uh, Rodney Garrett. Um, I, thought we, we, I thought we played the run first, reacted to the pass, uh, put pressure on the quarterback, didn't have any sacks, but we had a lot of hurries. I think we're responsible for the. Uh, we got there a bunch, and uh, I think you know, four, six turnovers, um, uh, which is a really good thing to see. It's been a point of emphasis for us. Um, uh, we had a good perimeter day. I, I think Washon was uh, uh, was effective uh, running at the edges, and you've always. You know, you got a block to run for any yardage. Um, Cody uh, ran the football team, is getting better every time he goes out there. I don't think he had one of his better games, and I know he's going to improve on it. Uh, but he is running his football team, and offensively, I think we are becoming the team that we want to be around <coughs> his skill set and his, his ability. Uh, we. Um, 4-0 in the league, uh, where we wanted to be, have a chance to come back home and um, after this next week and play the final four games to determine who's going to wear a ring on their finger. And um, uh, I'll say that I didn't say this to the team yet, but you know, this, this next game we're fixing to play really doesn't have anything to do with what the season's goal is, but it is a serious game for us. Um, it's become a measuring stick to some degree. Uh, we measure ourselves by these, what I call playing up games, playing somebody in an upper division. Um, we've gained a lot of pride the uh, last couple of years from, from playing these games. Um, this one, however, becomes to me <laughs> considerably different. Uh, if there ever was a sneak up factor, it's not there anymore. Um, and I don't know whether there ever was one there to begin with, but it, we're playing a football team that's in Kentucky that's had an open date that um, uh, certainly will bring everything they've got, which, uh, <coughs> which still, I think, makes it a competitive football game. We bring everything we got. We haven't, we haven't played with the efficiency uh, required to to uh, manage a game in this environment and of this caliber. But I think we're improving at the point, uh, improving to a point where you know, this game could, you know, could be highly competitive to the very end uh, with an opportunity to win. And we will go to the game to win the game. That's the only way we know how to do it. It's the only way we've gotten better and better playing these games. We have uh, a handful of players, please don't ask me who, but we got a handful of players that are just as good or better than the players they got at their positions. Uh, we have some guys that are going to be overmatched. 
Um, we're, you know, we're, we're going to have to fight on both ends of that issue. Uh, the guys that can make plays got to make plays. Uh, the guys that are just got to fight to hold it in level ground, they got to bring the fight to the fight to fight. Uh, I, I think we'll see a Kentucky team that is extremely determined and focused. And we, I think more than anything else, have got to match that determination and focus. Their quarterback, I've seen them play. It, it, it's just happened to where since we did play them, I, I found a Kentucky game since we played at night and they're playing during the day more. And uh, even though it was the Louisville game was at night, I watched it. So I, I've seen this team live in several games. I'm very impressed with the quarterback. Um, I think he is a playmaker. And um, and I, I do know the caliber of some of their athletes uh, defensively. I mean, they've got they've got two All SEC offensive linemen. They've got two players on defense: Winston Guy and, and Danny Trevathan, that are all American players, 21 and 22. Uh, so I mean, they they got some players. Um, this is a week for us just to stay focused on our business, not get caught up in any kind of storyline that. Um, distracts us from really what the issue is, and that's line up, snap the ball, execute, and do it the next play, and the next play, and the next play, and the next play. So, it's the only way we've been successful to the degree we have against these people. It's important to get off to a, or these caliber teams, or playing up teams. Uh, it's important for us uh, to be ready to play when we get there. Uh, I think the first five minutes will be important to us just to make whatever adjustment we got to make because there is an adjustment to be made uh, and, and get ready to make our plays. Any questions? We have some visitors from for the play. We appreciate y'all. Thanks for coming to see us. What's, what's the what's the honor of this occasion? I mean, we, uh, we missed you, Coach. Oh, I appreciate <laughs> <it>. <laughs> well, we're gonna start playing A and M again. That's what I want.